to find help. What do you know about Crane, anyway? Yeah, what do you know about That he has the stones to kill prostitutes like any common sex-frightened serial killer. <laughs> you don't know shit. Get out of here. Look, we know that Crane is going to see a witch, and it's to acquire a magic ring. What's the ring? We don't know what it does or who it's assigned to since Crane tore its page out of the book. This farce was your ridiculous idea for a plan. Who put you in charge in the first place? Nice. Fixing the mirror was the most logical You're thing. You're a secretary. He's the sheriff. And none of you were chosen to run this office. Piss off, Who elected you to make these decisions? Nobody, but that Who doesn't... elected her to spend my money? Well, I've been doing that unofficially for years now. Unofficially is not officially. I'm heading up the investigation, okay, Bluebeard? That makes this a moot point. And somebody needs to run the business office while he does so. Well, Bitch. Excuse me for having the Commonwealth in mind. Bitch! Alright, let's just look on the bright side. We know Crane is going to see the witch that's been supplying him black market mm -hmm. glamours. Thanks to me. And that <laughs> Thanks, he'll Buffkin. be there at two. So that gives us a few short hours to find out who it is and where they live and get them all okay. at once. All right. And a few shorter hours, the more you babble about it. We haven't been the ones babbling. Yeah, and that's if he's even going there. We're trusting a monkey's interpretation <laughs> of a phone call. It's not an interpretation. It's what he said, all right? Yeah, and it's what we have. So let's go on it, okay? All right. Since Lily let's used do the it. glamours, she'd have known who the witch was. And I don't think Holly's burned her things yet. It okay. would probably have the address or a phone number or something. Hey, and Bigby is free to go there if he likes. But I think the question you should be asking is just what do the two Tweedles know about this? It's it a good doesn't idea. matter what they know. After tonight, they never go to their office. They're not smart enough to try and go anywhere else. The trip trap is the better option to track uh. the witch down. That has to be our focus. Look, chances are I'll have to swing by both anyways. No, so. chances are you won't have time. Oh, God. I don't really care what you two do. Blue I'm Beard. going to his apartment. What? You can't just go up there. And why the hell not? We already looked for the key, remember? I don't know where it is. Why don't we just pick bust a it up? Blasted lock. <sighs> I've wasted enough time waiting for Why the do you care so much, Bluebeard? I won't waste any more. You just can't go up there alone, all right? I have no interest in nicking his drapes, my dear, if that's what concerns you. Bluebeard, why concerns do you care so much? Is you traipsing through possible evidence. Oh, now it's evidence. Before you had no interest, and now it's a crime scene. Hi. Bluebeard, you're not going anywhere. Really now? Yeah. And what? I'm the sheriff. You gonna stand here and babysit me while the rest of your leads evaporate into mist? We have to find the witch, Bluebeard, since that's where he's going. Or the sniveling weasel chickened out, never went anywhere, and is upstairs right now in his pitiful penthouse, crafting a fort out of couch cushions. <laughs> this is how a smart person would do it. So this is how we're going to do it. Wherever you go, I'll go to the other. I don't like you going anywhere unsupervised. I don't trust you right now, He's Bluebeard. Up to something. I don't know what it is, but we don't have the time to really worry about it now. I don't trust Where you right are you now. gonna go, Bigby? Oh, God damn it! Everywhere. So you leave Crane alone, and we leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. Ah, damn. I don't need sympathy, and I don't need charity. Ah, there's so many options. Ah, too much time. The D's, They're probably the best. So you leave Crane? D and Dumb must know where he is. I should go to their office first. Perfect. And I'll go to Crane's apartment. No. I'll look up their address. I hope you know what you're doing. Why are we letting him go upstairs? God damn it. Tie him to a chair or something. We shouldn't be letting him go wandering around. Who's this guy? Excuse me. Oh, hi. Sheriff Bigby. Great, great to see you. I don't know if you remember me. Sup, hipster? I've, uh, 
seen you around, but you may have forgotten. I know who you are, Flycatcher. You, you've worked at the Woodlands for how many years now? <sighs> I think I've lost count. But you know, Crane uh, let me go recently. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I mean, it's no big deal. What'd you do? So, what brings you here? I mean, can I help you with anything? Are you here to see one of the brothers? D or dumb? They, they aren't, they're in here right now. I'm not sure when they'll be back. You seen Crane around? Not around here. I saw him leave the woodlands earlier, but I'm not supposed to bother him. Ooh, I see, I see. I don't really think he likes me. I can it's imagine. It's been uh, a quiet night so far. I think the twins are out, probably working on a case. Okay, all Sometimes right. Sometimes I don't see them for days. They gave me the job after Crane told me to get lost. Uh. He said I was just in the way. Where's their office? Oh, right this way. I, I was going there next anyway. I can let you in if you want. You can wait for them there. Sure. Thanks. No problem. What a nice guy. I'm going to have to take a look around. Uh, well, I, I guess that would be okay. I wasn't really asking for permission. <laughs> right. You're the sheriff. I just don't want to get in trouble or anything. I'm sure it's fine. I mean, they never told me not to let you in. Don't worry. I won't get you in trouble. Right? You'll be all set, guy. Right. I'm sorry I stepped on that on the floor while you're trying to clean. My apologies, guy. Alright, let's take a peek around. Okay, we got a key in the cigar box. This? Uh, no. Okay, oh. Something's lagging up with a little, little, little bit of a storm here. Let's see if I can fix that. Hmm. Maybe it's just that this area is a little laggy. Alright, let's see if I can do some more stuff. Dear Brother D, I think we should get ourselves a dog. Sincerely, Brother Dumb. <laughs> They're dumb in they general. actually mailed this? They do have their quirks. <sighs> this is pointless. I wonder if it's just this area that's a little laggy, at least for recording. We'll see. Hopefully it cleans Dear itself Brother up. Dear Brother Dumb. I hate dogs, and you know it. Sincerely, Brother D. <laughs> a couple of freaks. I, I know these guys can come off abrasive at times, but they aren't so bad once you get to know them. They held a gun to me and shot and two they people. They really care about helping people. They're kind of loud at times, but you get used to it. I guess they have to be in their line of work. What do you mean? How do you mean they help people? They're detectives. Anyone can come in here with a problem and they'll do their best to fix it. Oh, wow. That cleaned up the way D explains it. It's like if someone lost their cat, well, they could hire them to, you know, track it down. Or like sometimes FBS they get packages picked up for quick. people. They can be like couriers, you know? Or who? All kinds. Come to think of it, I don't really know where they keep them. Mm-hmm. I see. Anyways, I'm just saying, you just don't know them like I do. Sure, flycatcher. Not that they just held the gun to me. Shot two of the people. Come on, Flycatcher, what do you got? I'm sure you have your reasons, but it's just they, they've done so much for me. Okay. Now, did I tell you about that time that Let's they shot they two people I know? On a crane. Oh, they do. Well, they have others, too. Let's see the beauty. This is worse than I thought. Shit. I don't know what any of that means. <gasps> Donkey skin. Ah, ha ha, that chick. Stole a photo from Crane, lovely find. Unconscious job. Crane hired them to look for a photo? So that's why they were at her apartment. And the woodsman's place. Okay. See, I knew you wouldn't find anything. Anything of interest, anyways. Oh, we're still they're, they're looking. detectives, like I said. Just, just trying to make an honest living. I haven't found anything yet. I'm just saying. Look, just trust me on this. Tweedledee and Dumb are not nice. They're not helping anyone. Well, they helped me. Okay, great, they helped you. That's one person. Now, please, just let me concentrate here. Come on, tell them they shot two people 
and almost and threatened you. That's not really helping. Detective Brannigan. Keep an eye on her. Hmm. I don't know what that is about. Okay, we got two more. Let's do Cinderella. Which we haven't really seen Cinderella yet, I don't think. Uh, the last one. There's Crane. Ichabod Crane. He owes the crooked man money. Shit. How was he planning to pay this all back? Request for property acquisition. Further details filed under donkey skin. Why okay. did he want it back so badly? Find anything? Not what I need. I wonder well, if the what picture... If, what if you're wrong about them? I'm not. They're misunderstood, sure, but that doesn't mean everything people say about them is true. Guy, yeah, you don't I mean, know. You know like when Jack. I think about it, you guys aren't that different. You help people, and they help people. Not that it's any of my business, but is that what you think? Bigby? Shit. There's something here. I know there is. There has to be. Why would there be anything? Because to they're lying to you, okay, flycatcher? That's why. They aren't detectives. They're somehow involved in the murders, Flycatcher. Two fables are dead. Bigby, what happened to your... <sighs> you want to know what this is? This is them showing up to Lily's funeral with fucking shotguns. I, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I, 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 I didn't know. Holly and Grant both got injured. Snow White nearly got her head blown off. Do you get it now? I bet he's got something to tell us. I, I, I didn't mean to... Oh, you know something? There's a door behind this file cabinet. Now, I don't know what they keep back here, but it might be what you're looking for. Thank you, buddy. Thank you, Flycatcher. Well, the key you found should work. So, you lied to us, huh? You knew what it was. You bastard. Thank you. Tell him thanks. Thank him. Do it. Ah, oh, Bixby. Is he gonna lock us in? Well, well, well. What do we have down here? It appears to be a meth lab. Wow. <laughs> okay, what do we got? That's a package. Hold for BCW. Huh. What are you looking for exactly? Maybe I can help. Something. Anything about Crane. Or the witch he was using. Something. Well, 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 what do we have here? JD. JD. I don't know who JD is. A book. This doesn't really tell us much. Take a peek at the book, man. Package. Butcher. What is this stuff? Stuff. Is that glam? ASAP. Oh. I'm sorry. I know I'm late. I'll get it to you soon. Ichabod Crane. Oh. Who was he sending money to? Crooked man. Care of the Lucky Pawn. Do you know what that is? Hmm. We'll leave it for now. I don't want to get caught with that money. Especially that if it's crooked money. I don't money. think so. But it's interesting. There's more going on here. Something Still about crooked man. That witch, though. Wonder if I need to take that money or something. Hmm. Crooked, crooked man. man. Uh huh. For your collection. Is that an egg? What is that? No idea. Pretty sure it's something they aren't supposed to have. This isn't the witch, though. 
Okay. What's this? Dust? Not seeing anything else. I probably have to take that money. I wonder if there's something in the money, maybe. Oh no, there's hey, this thing. Big B. Do you think after all this, do you think I could come back to the woodlands? Since Crane let me go, I mean I can still work here, but I don't think I want to now. I don't want to work with bad people, you know? You should talk to Snow. Maybe there's something she can do for you. Really? That would be... thank you. She's a cool chick. She might be able to help you. It's Snow's hair. Uh-oh. Snow White? Why... W we found her hair like this inside Lily's glamour. Okay. Anti-Greenleaf. Oh. This must be the witch Crane was using. Maybe. I guess D and Dumb were getting the hair for Crane and sending it to her? That's possible. That's not a pleasant thought. There's no address on it. So, so what now? Snow would probably want to know about this, don't you think? Oh, I didn't click it in time. I think Damn I it! I saw a phone near the back. Thanks. Oh, maybe I click You're welcome, on. Sheriff. Maybe. This is not this. This is Snow White. Hey, Snow. Oh, it's you. Sorry, I've been answering angry phone calls for hours. People want to know where Crane is. How'd it go with the Tweedle brothers? No address yet, but I got a name for Crane's witch, Auntie Greenleaf. You heard of her? No. I'll get Buffkin started looking for a record, but it might take some time. Huh. Somebody's got to know where to find her. And Snow, I found a note with some money attached. Crane has been embezzling from Fable Town. Of course, because why half-ass being a computer? <laughs> Do you think this is tied to the murders? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. Still have to find him. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, it could be. You might want to try Holly's place. See if she hasn't burned Lily's things yet. Okay. Or Crane's. You might find. Sounds there. like a plan. Bluebeard's been there. I'll leave it up to you, but we don't have much time. Crane is meeting her at two a.m. Hmm. <sighs> trip trap. I'll go to the trip trap. See about Lily's things. I think that's our best option. Sounds good. Just just be gentle with Holly when you get there, okay? Yeah, she's probably not in the best of moods right now. I'll give Buffkin the name and hope he finds something in the records. This guy right here. He comes up with. It's a little I'll sketchy. Be in touch. I hope you'll do the same. He's just we'll listening catch him to us. Bigby, I have to go. Someone just came in. Good luck. Ah. Uh, yeah. All right, Trip Trap, what do you got for me? Give me some some good news. Though these guys are probably a bit upset. <laughs> She's asleep, you fucking idiot. You didn't even give me a chance to explain. What's left to explain? Just, you know, what happened. We know what happened. Or how it happened. Why would she want to hear that? Well... Can I... Can you what? Can I just... I don't know. Just wait here for a bit. Until she wakes up. Then? <laughs> what do I mm. care? <clears throat> I need to talk to Holly. Are they going to open up? <clears throat> Oh, wow, he's plastered. Hey, look, Woody, it's the sheriff. Well, come on in, buddy. <laughs> he got so drunk. Grant, what? He's a traveler. A weary traveler in search of some hospitality, right? Yeah, sure. Thanks. Don't have any problems with you, Huntsman. Just need to get this case solved. I want a drink. Anybody else want a drink? 
Friend, Swinehart said you shouldn't mix you it. You think I give a fuck what that fucking guy says? <laughs> or what you say? This guy is plastered. Wait, really, you, you shouldn't drink right now. Swinehart told me that Holly was here. I need to talk to her. Holly's asleep in back. Okay. You won't be able to wake her. Really? Is she that drunk? And the doc gave him both barmesidal ambrosia for the pain. Look, the deal Interesting. is, if you resist going to sleep like I am right now, it gives you a very, very, very nice high. <laughs> well, I guess that is a... And he said that he shouldn't mix it with alcohol. <laughs> Something to entice you, I guess. Hey, buddy. You shouldn't drink that. Yes, he did. He certainly did. Well, let me tell you something. I haven't felt this good in a long time, mm. fat boy. Have you seen her sister's things? What wasn't burned at the funeral? I saw her come in with something, but okay. I didn't see where she put it. Mm. Nope, haven't seen it. Uh, he's gonna get so screwed up from it. That funeral back there? That was a shitty fucking send-off for a pretty okay lady. Yeah. yeah. You weren't fucking there. Talking to Bigby now, okay? <laughs> Poor Huntsman. <laughs> Can't say you being there helped things much. Well. Friend, don't start nothing. Who's starting anything? I'm not. No, right no. now, I couldn't give a shit what you think. No? No. Well, I can tell. I'm sorry, I just want to, you know, get Kane. It's alright. I'm too out of it to get into it. I want to clear the air. We're all in this dung heap of a fucking shit town together. And we're all gonna have a toast. All of us. Oh, Ellis, God. I'm here for one thing. To look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Now, yeah, what? yeah, I know, I know. And I want to help you, okay? I'm sure you want to help and me, I buddy. Will. But first, you don't really have a good liking of me. Take two seconds. As a show of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. Oh, God. Friend, Bigby didn't come here to get loaded with you. I don't want to get loaded with him. I'm running out of time, Gren. Sorry, Gren. Another time. Oh, God. Gren, the doc said you needed to rest. How many times you fucking wow. gonna warn me about it, huh? You're not my fucking mother, so just get off my this back. This guy's out of I it. I said I was sorry, all right? I can't do anything about it. It's done. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> all right, get out of here, guys. Back up. What more do you want? What else can I fucking say here? Cut this shit out now. Yeah. I don't care what it's about. Oh, I forgot. You haven't heard the news. Oh, this walking lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our backs. And Holly Wait, had what? to find out going through all of her sister's shit. What fun that must have been. Trick after trick of this fat ass and Lily. I didn't plan for that, all right? And our thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. Jesus Christ, just going down. It wasn't. I never fucked her when she was snowing. I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew Holly would flip out. And you knew for a damn good fucking reason. Well, they're both grown consenting adults. You know what? Exchanging Fuck a little this. bit of money. I don't need this shit. Oh yeah, that's it. Now you're teary-eyed. You were always God such damn a low a bitch. I don't know why I never realized it till now. <sighs> what do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can think whatever he wants. I don't give a shit. No, that's okay. Grant, I'll tell you off. things. I think whatever happened was between them, and Lily is dead. So let's put this whole thing to rest, Grant. Huntsman, I'm sorry for the mistakes that I've or the punches the the the, the, the beating that you that you'd received before. But Grant, I need to see that shit. We need to I find don't know the killer. Where Lily's shit is. <sighs> Check Holly's room, I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. I thought you said I couldn't wake her. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's the rule. Maybe, uh, ogres, too. Thanks for the... Actually, Big B, if you'll excuse me, it 
Seems that I'm gonna pass <laughs> out. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. And out goes Gren. He won't remember this. <laughs> He's probably so bla blasted right now, it doesn't even matter. Oh, is she gonna be laying on it or something? All right, well, let's try not to wake her. Something under there. Crate of alcohol. Oh, Vigs, be careful. What little noises we make, buddy. Let's take a look at the cut. All right, there. That looks like something. Oh, perfect, perfect timing. We need to shimmy that little bad boy out from under there. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. All right, so what do we got in the little box here? We got a photo. We got some alcohol. Maybe alcohol. Oh, it might be the the, the potion stuff. That you, Woody? No. Uh, Woody, is that you? No, Holly. It's me, Bigby. Bigby. Bar's closed. All right. And excuse me, but I'm not in the mood for That's anything. fine. You can just go back to sleep. But what the fuck? I know you're not going to leave. You do what you want. You always <laughs> do what you want. All right, that's the plan. Um, bottle of wine. Take a peek at the picture. Hey, there's a there's a deer dumb in the back. Uh. Do you even give a shit about us, the strays? Of course I do. I'm the sheriff. The ones that aren't in that fancy high rise. Those of us that gotta work for a living. Holly, just because I live in the woodlands doesn't mean I'm not one of your strays. I'm not Crane or Cole. I didn't exactly grow up wearing clothes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know you didn't. We're pretty, pretty outcastish, outcastish ourselves. Glamour tube, book, brooch. Anything useful on it? Or just a brooch? No, it just looks like a brooch. Why'd you even come here? There's nothing here to investigate. I can't be any use to you. I need to, uh, look through your sister's things. To look for clues? Yes. Um, if you want to put it that way. Uh, alright, let's take a look at the glamour tube. Wonder if this is the uh, glamour tube that she was using kind of looks uh, reminiscent of the didn't we have that other tube that was like that hmm it's been a while I don't remember, quite remember I think we did in the uh, second episode oh actually be spoke. honest sheriff why are you going after him the guy that killed Lily because it's he the right thing to do quit a long time ago but you're still going. I'm the Why? sheriff. It's my job. Did they give you this job for a reason? Or was this the only thing the business office would let you do? I'm doing this for Lily. She deserves whatever justice I can get her. I'll take it. She won't remember this. She's gone. I bet that's a call for us. Uh, We're getting your glamour on this day, and one of these has to be the witch. Auntie Greenleaf. Gotcha. Hello, this is Snow White calling. I'm looking for Bigby. Okay. Is anyone there? Bigby yeah. Is there. Pick up, okay? All right, pick it up. Pick it up. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Pick up. Snow. Oh, thank God. Tell me you found something. I got it, sir. Uh, Her address was here with Lily's things. It's on uh, White Plains Avenue, 1284. It's an apartment complex. 
Great. Let's get going. Crane's meeting her in a few minutes. All right, let's go. I don't want to miss him. Let's go. There. All right, I'll see let's you ride. Oh, are we gonna find him? Are we gonna find Anti Green? 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 Was it Anti Green? Something? 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 Ag? Big B. I just got here. Yeah, me too. It's number twenty-three. I haven't seen it yet. We're late. Yeah, Anti Green lives. This is it. All right. How do you want to do this? Hmm. Let's go to our option. Let's listen. Hear anything? If anyone's not, what you're talking? They're being awfully quiet. Let's just see if it's unlocked. Hey now, I'm a little old lady. Hello. Hi. You woke me up. Uh, sorry about that. Is something wrong? Well, pardon the intrusion. I wasn't aware this was a munchkin's house. Well, Dorothy, it isn't. <laughs> <laughs> Sharp kid. <laughs> oh. Do you have a name? Rachel, who are you? Just so we're not strangers. I'm Big B. Big B. This is Snow. Pleased to meet you. How do you do? What a nice little girl. Is there, um, is there anything you need? Is Auntie Greenleaf at home? Does she live here? You mean my mom? She yeah. ever, you know, make the nightstand levitate, turn frogs into cats, that kind of thing. Is she a witch, dear? Oh, no, I would never call my mommy that. She treats me all right. <laughs> Is there something you want? I don't think I can really help you. Uh, Rachel, do you mind if I take just a quick peek around? We'll be very quick, and he won't touch anything. The sheriff. I've been here all night. Nobody's been here. Oh, you seem awfully... Awfully uh, jumpy there, okay, little girl. Baby. I'm gonna trust you not to break anything. Don't get me in trouble. What are we looking for specifically? Crane. He could still be here. <laughs> I bet the little girl's crane. Hmm. No one's been over all night, so. He's just going to check. It'll only take a moment. You seem a little, a little, little jumpy there, little girl. A little scared. What you scared of? Out of here. There's no one here but me. Oddly enough, I don't believe you, little girl. Where are you hiding him? Where do you buy your clothes? At a store. At a what store. What is this? Mommy uses that to carve her trinkets. It's from the old world. Trinkets? Um, like glamours? <laughs> Nothing that looks like Crane was here either. Nothing? See? <laughs> You're a smart ass. Hmm. Well, let's take a picture. It's pretty rare to see a burner like this. <sighs> Dowdy. That's how we like it. Do you like broccoli? Not really. Your mama hunter? Oh no, she never. That was found in the woods around Dick's Mountain, I think. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That your mom? Uh-huh. Let All me right. guess. Big band or classical? Honky tonk. <laughs> no accounting for taste. Dun 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 closet door. The butcher. The butcher. What's that? A package having to do with someone called the butcher. I saw one just like it at the Tweedle's office. Hmm. Hey, little girl, who's the butcher? Damn it. I shouldn't say that. Nothing. I keep getting whiffs of that 
aftershave of his. I do too. Uh... Can I go to bed now, please? Uh... Is that a glamour tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I tried. We did say we weren't going to touch anything, but... No, 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 please, 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 just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigby's not going to break no, it. I don't understand. She will freak out if she discovers I've let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. Snow, come on. Are you kidding? It's a glamour tube. Something's going on here. No! Put it down! Please, don't! This isn't what you think! You gotta believe me! The guy isn't here, I promise! It's gonna be okay, Something sketchy. Please, I'm begging you! I don't wanna... I don't wanna get in trouble! I bet you're crying, aren't you, little girl? <laughs> Anti-green leaf. Oh, well, Anti green leaf. It hurts when you do it that fast. <laughs> What? Not so. No more bullshit, enough. chick. You picked the wrong night to lie to me. No more lying, no more ring around the rosy, no more bullshit non sequiturs. You're done. It's over. You're gonna tell me what I wanna know right now. All right, let's start explaining. And from the beginning. I was born in the woods to a jackal and a Where's Crane? Speak quickly. I ain't a fortune teller, wolf. Mm -hmm. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. Well, you, you have knew he to was know here. Something. Unless you want a recipe for owl stew, there's nothing I know that would help. Just why in the name of everything holy are you protecting this weaselly scumbag? I mean, what on earth could he have done to deserve this kind of loyalty? Crane could be hollow bones tomorrow, and you wouldn't see me cry a drop. Uh huh. I see. But that doesn't Is he your lover? tell you anything. You have friends, don't you? Well, I don't want Crane's friends for enemies. Please, Greenleaf. Crane is a murderer and he's escaping. You might want to check your facts on that. What do you mean? It doesn't matter. Hey, I, can't no, no, no. Uh, 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 uh. I have no interest in being turned no, into no, 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 a no, no, no. and crushed under boot heels. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. Unless someone was glamoring whatever to be crane. Whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something, you have to forget it. This is more important. Is it? I don't give a shit about your problems, Greenleaf. Just talk. Now. You have no idea what's going on, do you? Spell it. I want to okay, know. You know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap. If she's afraid for her life, we can at least make sure she never hurts us again. We're destroying the tree. No! Oh, oh. How dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, mm -hmm. and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the fables who can't afford the glamours from you come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making money off of other people's misery. Two fables are dead because of this crap. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. Mm -hmm. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. Very different means to handle it, too. And I don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives. Mm. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but please, don't do this. Isn't there she another could way? could be useful, She's maybe? She's a witch. Can't she just work for us? That way she'd be official. You want to reward her for <laughs> criminal behavior? Come on. You can't trust Come on. this woman on the 13th floor. It doesn't matter, because I'd never do it. I'm not a house cat, and I don't play well with others. Oh, trust me. No one would confuse you for a cuddly animal. <laughs> Snow, you're so angry. Bigby, this is an order. Burn the tree. No! Look, look, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. 
Crane was here. He was here and he left. Where? He went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. You know, that it will pierce the protection around the girl's speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. Mm -hmm. It won't, though. Damn thing lost its power decades ago. I'm sorry, but we still can't let you keep the tree. It wouldn't be right after what's happened. Big B. Please, Sheriff. Don't. <sighs> I have a heart a little bit. Okay, well, I guess I see where I stand with you. God damn it. All right, let's go. There's no winning. There's no winning. Hey, Greenleaf. I'll burn the tree later. Don't think this is over. I won't. She did give me some information that was useful. So I can't necessarily, in goodwill, burn her tree. Maybe later. <laughs>